Is your iPad dropping Wi-Fi like it's allergic to the internet? Relax. It's not the router going through a midlife crisis. It's usually the iPad just acting up. So let's fix that. Force restart the iPad. Don't just turn it off. That's like napping through the problem. This reset actually resets the Wi-Fi chip driver. You get to do that. All you got to do is press the volume up, volume down, and hold the top button until you see the Apple logo. Remember, a hard reboot equals a Wi-Fi reset. Forget and then rejoin your network. Remember, after updates, your old Wi-Fi information can get scrambled. It's like trying to use an old password at a new door. So head to your settings, go to your Wi-Fi, and tap that little I next to the Wi-Fi name. Then tap Forget Network, give it a couple seconds, then reconnect. Remember, a fresh handshake equals a stable signal. Still nothing? How about we try turning off your private Wi-Fi address? You see, the setting is great if you're in coffee shops and you need privacy, but at home, it can just confuse a router. Yeah, so head to settings, Wi-Fi, and tap on the Wi-Fi network, then toggle off the private Wi-Fi address. And boom, about 90% of random drops should be gone. Just remember to turn it back on when you're using a public Wi-Fi. Congratulations, your router now recognizes you. Time for a bonus tip. If it's still ghosting your Wi-Fi, I'm afraid it's time to go nuclear. So head to settings, general, transfer or reset iPad and tap on reset network settings. Don't worry, there's no data loss here. Just a clean slate for all your connections. But you will have to remember your Wi-Fi password. So good luck with that. Just remember, network wipe equals fresh start. So to recap, force restart, forget the network, ditch the private address and reset if needed. Done. If that stopped your iPad from rage quitting your Wi-Fi, hit the thumbs up and let us know your next tech headache. Yeah, because let's be honest, it's not your Wi-Fi really. It's just iPad OS being, well, iPad OS.